There is a new therapeutic approach being used worldwide for the treatment of idiopathic scoliosis, a curvature of the spine due to unknown causes. The breakthrough involves the combination of a revolutionary non-rigid brace called spine core, supported by unique cutting-edge technology. My life is dedicated to the cause of prevention of cure of scoliosis. Um, I've been dealing with it for 30 years. I've had four surgeries now. Most of my back is all fused. More importantly though, I have seven family members with scoliosis. I have two daughters with it. Idiopathic scoliosis usually appears in pre-adolescence and is particularly progressive in young girls during their growth peaks. It is a time of life when appearance and mobility are extremely important. The standard treatment has been a rigid brace constructed of plastic. It clearly limits movement and the cumbersome device is not easily concealed. Rigid braces immobilize not just the spine, but the entire torso. When worn for a long period of time, in many cases, physicians could see an underdeveloped rib cage and atrophy of related muscles caused by rigid braces. If patients were hoping for a better treatment, so were their doctors. In fact, most doctors were delaying bracing because patients found the long treatment too difficult to endure. Now, physicians may intervene earlier and it's easier on the patients. Based on a revolutionary scientific approach, the research team of Dr. Charles Hilaire Rivard and Dr. Christine Coyard at St. Justine's Hospital in Montreal developed a dynamic flexible brace for treatment of idiopathic scoliosis. Alors, l'objectif initial était de trouver un corset dynamique permettant une meilleure assiduité du malade et il est dynamique parce que ce sont des bandes élastiques qui fonctionnent sur un mouvement correcteur qui, qui sont dans les trois plans de l'espace. 85% of scoliosis occurs between the ages of 10 and 15 years of age. In the United States, there's somewhere around 36 million children within that age range. Now we know that the incidence of scoliosis is 3%. So if you take 3% of 36 million children, you're now talking about a million children with this condition. Spine core is now being used by orthopedists worldwide. The dynamic brace consists of corrective and adjustable elastic bands, which are interconnected to three static components, creating a modular system. This allows physicians to customize treatment, and it can be worn beneath the patient's clothing. Unlike a rigid brace, spine core allows a child to be treated without interfering with or preventing their normal daily activities. Ce qui est bouleversant, c'est, je pense, de, de, de maintenir et de privilégier ce mouvement, de, cette, cette possibilité d'activité euh, dynamique et d'activité sportive pour l'enfant, euh, tout en corrigeant sa courbure. You can clearly see the S-shaped curve on X-rays. The doctors also developed the Spine Core Assistant software, a way of creating a database of information for fitting the brace and tracking the patient's clinical data over time. What we're doing with the rigid bracing is a passive force. You're just forcing that over and holding it, and it's not allowing the body to move along with that, so that just goes right back to its natural shape. With Spine Core, because it's working naturally with the body, it's, it's a dynamic, it's over time and we see it's a much more natural, a little bit slower, but actually we end up with the same result or better. Spine core is now being prescribed in many scoliosis centers worldwide. Researchers are now collecting long-term data to confirm the early, promising results of treatment with spine core. Et je pense que le, la, la, la plus grande révolution là-dedans, c'est de se rendre compte que l'on peut corriger, maintenir et corriger des courbures avec des forces relativement minimes à partir du moment où on préserve le mouvement. Donc on n'est plus obligé d'appliquer des forces euh, euh, importantes et, et qui peuvent être à certains points, à certains points traumatisantes et même provoquer certaines lésions cutanées. Et en fait, on s'est rendu compte qu'on pouvait traiter tout un échantillonnage de, de, de différentes courbes, plus ou moins flexibles, et avec de très bons résultats. Et on obtient euh, même des corrections euh, très, très impressionnantes. Je pense qu'avec le spine core, c'est une approche naturelle pour avoir le corps de spine correct, pour le remettre dans la position rather than forcing it over, which has been the traditional way uh, for many years um, in this country as well as the world. Spine core is more easily accepted by patients, which allows physicians to treat them earlier. Preliminary results are very promising. The technology which supports spine core, spine core assistant software,
make spine core the world's first dynamic corrective brace for the treatment of idiopathic scoliosis. The child themselves, they want to have, if they need a treatment, they want a treatment that isn't seen by everybody. They want to have it the least intrusive, the least invasive, um, the least painful, et cetera, that they can have. I think spine core meets that need. Not only does spine core permit freedom of movement, it is also easily concealed. Spine core preserves a child's self-image, overcoming a major obstacle to treatment. On leur supprime pas toute l'activité sportive, qu'on leur supprime pas leur vie quotidienne normale, jouer avec les amis. Euh, ça reste très discret sous les vêtements. Elles peuvent en parler, elles peuvent ne pas en parler. Euh, elles, elles ne sont pas considérées comme des handicapées. In the words of Dr. Coyard, the breakthrough was to look at young patients not as statues, but as functioning human beings capable of movement. We have an opportunity within this, this next couple of decades to make a difference. Spine core. Movement is life.